Now, we need to discuss the latest therapies for combating this diabetes-related disease. Here's what we have in 2025 as a possible solution. Diabetic retinopathy, DR treatment, has advanced a lot in the last 10 to 15 years. Instead of relying mainly on destructive laser therapy, modern approaches now focus on preserving vision, repairing vessels, and reducing inflammation angiogenesis. Here's a breakdown of the most modern treatment methods as of 2025. 1. Intravitreal anti-VF injections, first-line therapy. These are now the standard of care for vision-threatening diabetic retinopathy, particularly diabetic macular edema, DME. How they work. Block vascular endothelial growth factor, reducing abnormal vessel growth and leakage. 2. Corticosteroid implants. Used if anti-F is ineffective or not tolerated. Target, reduce inflammation and leakage in the retina. 3. Modern laser approaches. Laser is less commonly first-line now but still used in selected cases. Panretinal photocoagulation, PRP, still standard for proliferative DR, but anti-VGF is often tried first. Subthreshold micropulse laser, a gentler, non-damaging approach for diabetic macular edema, preserves more retinal tissue compared to conventional laser. 4. Vitrectomy surgery, for advanced DR, indicated when there's non-resolving vitreous hemorrhage, retinal detachment, or severe scar tissue. Modern vitrectomy uses small-gauge, high-speed cutters, safer, faster recovery, less trauma.